Per prepararci a Ier abbiamo sentito alcuni dei vincitori di Palma de Mallorca, tra cui anche gli azzurri Tita e Banti. Uh, it was a great, great position for us, you know, going into to the meadow race already having won. Um, really meant that we could just focus on the race itself and, and not really worry about where our competitors were. And um, we had a really good race, you know, it was pretty tricky conditions and um, to come away with, with another win, you know, it was pretty, pretty special. It's, been, it's nice, it's nice to be back here again. You can see so many teams come to, to, to see so many sailors and showcase our sport like this. Nice coloured water. A little bit colder than the summer in Australia, but uh, great to be back racing and a yeah, really good event and I'm sure there'll be a lot of teams coming back the next few years for sure. Yeah, it's really, you know, really special. I, I, I love this, this event, you know, being uh, first time I, I came here was 2001. Um, so, you know, 16 or 17 times and it really shows, um, you know, credit to, to the organisers and um, also the conditions and for here to have so many boats, it's just, you know, fantastic and to come away with You know, with the overall trophy, it's, it's special. You know, we, we focus on what we need to do and it's the first event in the season, so I guess high expectations for the rest of the year for us. Um, but, you know, we, we love this event and um, to come away with, with not only the win, but the overall win, it's, it's, it's one, of those, one of those things that's pretty, pretty cool. This year to qualify ourselves for the Olympics in Aarhus, there's 10 spots up for grab, so uh, we need to try to make sure that we get one of them and hopefully we're the top Australian. So it puts us in a good position for, for next year and the year after. Muy, muy intensa. Eh, largamos y había bandera individual. Y estábamos, sabíamos que habíamos largado muy justos, pero por suerte volvió el polaco y el inglés. Y esos, algunos de los dos o los dos estaban pasados, así que ahí planteamos nuestra regata y siempre fuimos para adelante. Y terminamos terceros. Y el inglés creo que séptimo y ahí fue que se nos dio. No, antes eh, del campeonato no, vinimos aquí en busca de un podio. Esta temporada teníamos ganas de, de dar ese salto. El año pasado nos quedamos en varios eventos cuartos. Y el primer día fue difícil, estábamos en el 25, pero todo muy cerca. Y de ahí siempre fuimos navegando muy bien y confiando en nosotros cada día un poquito más. Y bueno, se dio este premio que, que venimos buscando hace bastante. Sí, el objetivo para todos es eh, primero que nada conseguir la plaza olímpica en Arus y una sorpresa, queríamos un podio igual ganar, era, veíamos algunos equipos más fuertes que nosotros aún, así que esta semana ha sido muy buena, pero ahora a continuar trabajando porque para agosto todavía quedan muchas cosas por delante. It was good. Um, unfortunately, the medal race we didn't have. The wind didn't really play ball, which was a bit of a shame, but we've had a great, great week of racing here and yeah, I'm stoked to come away with a, with a victory. Well, everything's building towards the World Championships in Aarhus, so this is now my second event of the year. Um, and it's, you know, I think it's nice to be able to say that thing, things are on track, but there's still an awful lot, a lot of work to do. And um, yeah, the big, the big goal of the year is the, is the World Championships in Aarhus. It's not too much new I'm testing, it's, um, i said that uh, you know coming to Princess Sophia is always a always such a popular event for everybody because it it is the the start of the European season uh, and it's a great great opportunity to to have a look at what the fleet's up to and where everyone's at. Um, so yeah, it's great to be able to come here and and be able to to win. Yeah, of course we uh, you know we Olympic Olympic sport and it is always all about the Olympics and uh, yeah so Tokyo is the Is of course the is of course the end goal. Everything else is uh, is just part of the journey, really. Okay. It was really nice to win it before the medal race, but it was even nicer to win the medal race as well. We had a very good week, and uh, we're happy to finish it like this. No, I think we had a really uh, nice regatta. We had good conditions, good uh, all the races. Well, yeah. yeah, we're first going to go to here and do the whole pre-season and then Aries will be a big event for us and then uh, the next step is Tokyo, but we're with the big squads in Holland. We have four boats and uh, we're just trying to <laughs> become better and better with four boats and then we'll see uh, who will be the best in the end. È stata bellissima, è <laughs> la prima, prima regata della stagione per noi, regata internazionale e si vede che stiamo lavorando nella direzione giusta, questo inverno abbiamo lavorato bene quindi siamo molto contenti. E è stato importante vincere questa regata con un giorno d'anticipo, vuol dire appunto Munice Ruggero 
e siamo, stiamo lavorando nella, nella direzione giusta. Siamo a un, a un buon livello ma ancora c'è tanto da lavorare. E ci aspettavamo di andare bene ma di andare così tanto bene sinceramente io no. Eh, sicuramente vincere con un giorno d'anticipo eh, fa capire di essere ben, ben, ben più avanti degli altri, quindi in questo momento non era quello che ci aspettavamo, siamo contenti e continueremo così. Credo che sia molto divertente, è una sfida ogni giorno. <ride> Bello perché impariamo qualcosa di nuovo ogni giorno e quindi ci, ci motiva e ci stimola a navigare tutti i giorni anche 5 minuti in più. Esattamente, l'obiettivo dell'anno è eh, il mondiale a, um, ad Arus, eh, che è la prima tappa per qualificare la nazione, quindi l'obiettivo è qualificare la nazione e fare anche un buon campionato. Per... Sì, noi ci siamo allenati tutto l'inverno a Cagliari con i nostri compagni di squadra che sono Vittorio Bissaro e Mael Frascari che purtroppo non sono riusciti a qualificarsi nella medal race questa regata e assieme a loro anche con gli altri tre equipaggi italiani e tra cui uno appunto Bressani che invece questa regata è andato molto bene.